Hey guys, I'm your host Jennifer Tapiero, backstage here at the Dolby Theater at America's Got Talent, hanging out on the red carpet with so many talented people. That's to catch up with Simon Cowell. How you doing? Good. We're both New Yorkers. Okay, let's get oh. you. Oh. Let's get you in the center, a little bit more over this way. Oh, oh where's my friend? Where do you go? Oh, oh you look. <laughs> like magic, like that. Scooch, bada bing, bada scooch. scooch. Like this way? Oh, that's like backwards. There you go. It's like backwards, right, Leandre? All right, so. Yeah, that's that's right. Carpet life, you know, that is life. How you feeling? What's that's going on? Life. Yeah, life. I'm feeling great. That? I'm feeling like a million bucks. You sounded like a million bucks. Thank you. You slayed it. Like a million bucks. Yeah, you, you say see this thing. Ready? This is my favorite part about this thing. You open it up. Yeah. Bam! The Bijan yellow. How you doing? The Bijan yellow. You feel that? They hey. Had, they had me feeling like Julia Roberts on uh, on Rodeo Drive the other day. You. I well, first I walk in with Tommy, Big Tommy, and he's got the cut off and all the tattoos, and they're sizing him up like he's gonna steal something out of the bathroom. <laughs> but uh, you know, I mean, people were nice enough to reach out, especially Nicholas Bijan, the guy who who started the the, the store over there. His favorite song was My Way, mm -hmm. and when Nicholas heard it, he played it maybe 40 times. He was telling me, and uh, you know, just to feel like I'm inspiring people like that, big names like that. Uh, it means a lot to me. All I want to do is make people smile for the rest of my life. Honestly, I want to make people laugh. I want to make people, you know, enjoy the music that I'm singing. I'm singing feel-good music, and, and I think that's what the world needs right now. We really need that. I mean, uh, music is healing. It's therapeutic. We need that. We need you to do that for we us. We just need positivity. We, we need, need to be all right out there, you know? We need positivity, and we need people like you to spread it. Thank you very much. I, I think I will. I think we're going to try. We'll do I mean, our best. You're doing amazing on this show. Thank you developing such a great fan base people are loving you i mean you're pretty you're getting pretty close yeah, you know what? i feel closer to that million dollar prize and that show in vegas every day but what matters is that i'm getting out there and and i'm making people happy like i said before uh but i think we could do this you know i think that that every week i you know the hardest thing to do is raise the bar on this show because mm. a you have acts here, all of them, who in any other season would have slayed the competition. And we're all in this together. It's such a huge, huge season. 15 million viewers an episode. That's, it's absolutely incredible what they've been able to do here. Uh, but you got to keep raising the bar every single time you go back out there. And uh, I, I, I think we're, we're doing okay with that. Tonight, you really did such a great job. The judges loved it. Got some great feedback. Simon. Simon says. Simon says. And Simon is a titan in this industry. Yeah. He said that, he goes, I feel like you want to win. I feel like you want to win. And that resonated with me. You know, Heidi saying, I got a heart of gold. You know, that, that meant a lot to me because America doesn't get to know the guy, you know, behind. Behind the voice, on the mic. Right? Well, yeah, the guy behind the voice. And, uh, you know, I, I, I feel like that was nice to have out there, you know. Well, you're a New Yorker. You're lovable. Uh, of course. Represent, you know, um, only thing is. Where are you from? We're Long Island, raised in Jersey. My mom's from Queens. My grandma still lives there and thinks she's Jersey. Can't all be perfect. I still got a 732 area code. <laughs> Queens, where Queens? Kew Gardens? Oh, I go to St. John's. Well, you know, one thing about California, I wish they had some talent to make some good pizza, you know? I'm thinking, like, once my, once my career in the entertainment industry has, has come and gone, I'll take some of that money I saved up, open up a pizzeria, right? Yeah. Ship in the water. Like Larry from, King. Right? From the East Coast. Larry King has a pizzeria where he he's ships a, in the water. He's got a bagel store. He ships in the water. Bagel store. Okay, thank God. I'll open it up in the same shopping center. Yeah. We'll do a strip mall, just like home. We'll get some good Chinese in there, too. <laughs> right? And we'll do uh, it'll Make be. It gluten free. <laughs> Whoa, with this gluten free. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> Nothing's free. You got to charge more for gluten. <laughs> catching up with you you look great you sounded great and of course you know the, the fans are loving you this is generation that's our show say hello for us how you doing generation sal the voice valentinetti at sal the voice on facebook instagram and twitter make sure you watch agt every tuesday and wednesday night on nbc how you doing she wants to take a, she wants to take a picture how you yes. doing